A Testament Against the World, The Lord's Rebuke, Epilogue, A New and Terrible Thing, December 5th, 2011, From the Lord, Our God and Savior, The Word of the Lord Spoken to Timothy, For All Those Who Have Ears to Hear. Thus says the Lord, Behold, I have come down. Yes, I am here. I have come down to dwell in my chosen, and to deliver my elect, even every lamb. For I am the Lord, and my jealousy has come to the full. I shall no more tolerate all this injustice and murder, all these abominations, all this wickedness. I shall no more endure all this persecution, even by my own people, who pollute my name day and night without ceasing. For I shall stand upon the earth in my fierce anger and repay, and I shall defend my elect and protect the weak and the needy, and the cause of the widow shall be fulfilled in her deliverance. For I am Lord and God, the Deliverer. Yes, I am He. Behold, look, for the Lord your God shall do a new thing, a new and terrible thing, an astonishment, a great wonder, the likes of which this world has never seen. The faces of the multitudes shall pale, the hearts of many shall fail them for fear. Many shall collapse, gathering blackness, on account of that which is coming to pass before their eyes. The mighty and awesome power of the Lord your God put on open display. For who can stand against his coming? Who will not fall down at the sound of his voice? Thus says the Lord, It is time. My hand shall reach down. Lo, it shall plunge into the earth. It shall pass through every tomb and every mausoleum, through every grave. Behold, my hand shall pass through the dust and sift the sands of the desert. Even unto the depths of the sea my hand shall grab hold, and the whole earth shall give up its dead. Every child of God, every servant of the Most High, every sheep beloved of the shepherd. Then shall I turn to the multitudes and pass through. Behold, I shall pass through and steal them away. Babes from every womb, children from every corner, and my elect from every nation. The world shall be left utterly desolate and in tears. Heavy sorrows shall overtake every land. Behold, an outcry shall rise up, such as has never been heard. Much weeping and lamentation, anger and many raised fists, a great gnashing of teeth. Yes, among every tribe, people and nation, a great noise shall be heard. For three full days it shall not subside, and for three full nights it shall not lessen. Thus shall their first reward be given, for they have shown themselves fully worthy. Then shall they know. I am the Lord. And thus shall the great and terrible day of the Lord begin. Behold, the wrath of the Lamb.